The Uganda Management Institute, UMI, bids farewell to the outgoing Chancellor, Florence Mugasha, amidst the challenges of space for the increasing number of students. Florence Mugasha says although a lot has been achieved and had to newer since 2006 to date, there is still a need for the government to increase funding to allow the institute meet its current demands. I appeal to government is really to consider increment of funds for staff development and closing a funding gap of approximately 15 billion, complete and finish and finish the first phase of the estate development master plan. This current construction at the institute is being facilitated by the Netherlands grant of 3.45 million US dollars, but the management says the construction now needs over 15 billion shillings for completion without furnishing. Our biggest problem now is lack of space because of money. So one would say uh, funds are a problem. But we are trying our best. We raise our own funds and also we get uh, uh, supplemented by government and by other agencies. But as Mugasha leaves, professionalism is another task left for the institute management to handle. To increase on PhD holders, to get more money for training, so that we have more people who can handle the PhD program and that will mean sponsoring many people to go back and do PhD and come and serve in the institute. As long as we have the correct policies in place, we, we, we are sure that as we move on, this professionalization will grow from strength to, to strength. The UMI management commended Florence Mugasha for her analytical strategies for handling management and the patience that saw the institute grow steadily up to the current stage, which they say will be difficult to find a replacing. Stephen Mwiri, WBS News.